gnome And my thoughts keep telling me to get me home But my thoughts keep telling me to let me out Oh, just let me out How's it going lads, Marshall here and welcome to the first Legend review of FIFA 14. Now this guy's going to set you back a turn, both on the Xbox One and the Xbox 360, unfortunately not available for the PlayStation 3. Now guys, if you're looking for coins to get this guy, check out UT Coins now, the link's in the description below, use that code MARSHALL5 for a 5% discount. Now Paulo Futra is a legend, especially for Atletico Madrid, and there's a nice little new feature that you will see very soon, now he's got a 5 star weak foot and a 4 star skill move set, so this guy is very nifty with the board, his feet because you can see those card stats on the left hand side and as we switch over you can actually see these card stats on there as well but this is the new feature lads claim to fame I like this I like this a lot it's got um, his kind of bio there at the top he's got his club career his national career and as you can see he played for Atletico Madrid more than anyone else actually spent some time in England as well with West Ham now this guy's ball control is amazing and with that dribbling as well my god this guy is a dribbling machine he's got 98 penalties as well which from the spot he doesn't miss unless you just just crap at taking penalties, which I am, but I didn't actually miss one with him, so I don't even know why I'm bringing that up. Now, this guy's work rates are high to low, so perfect for an attacking player, and as you can see, that strength, that strength is so damn low, which does affect this guy, but he is that agile, he's that good with the ball at his feet, he's balanced all the time, he's got very high balance and agility, this guy can just dance past everybody. Now, this is my first game with the card over on that left wing. As you can see, it's current gen, and this will be my last video in current gen for these reviews anyways. As you can see, a nice little finish there. After dancing down that left-hand side like a ballerina. Yes, he did get dispossessed at one point, but he kept the ball. And how about this for a goal, lads? My God. Jesus Christ. What a finish that is. That was his weak foot. Weak foot, now you're taking the piss, mate. Five-star weak foot. Crack and strike. That is just not a weak foot. I don't even know how that can be classed as a weak foot. What a hit. With that right boot of his, yes, he can use both feet. And he can come in from either side, which I did kind of say earlier on. Just look at this for a strike. Crack and strike. Crack and save. And that was all in my first game. This is the second half of extra time in that first game. And how close does he come with this left foot? That left foot of his is a diamond. It is unbelievable. Unbelievable. And just look how good he is on this left hand side, which is his natural position. Yes, he can swap wings and he can get even better. And how about this for a finish yet again? Dinking it below the goalkeeper. I didn't even know that was possible, but he puts it in the net yet again. Cracking little strike. And the strikes just keep getting better and better from this guy. This is just a normal finish, which you don't expect from pretty much anyone in the game. But the pace, the dribbling, the control, the finish. Everything about this guy is good. He's pros with his long shots, he's cutting inside, he's dribbling and ball control. His cons price, obviously, 1 million. That is just not cheap on either console, even though you can't get him on the PlayStation. But, my God, this guy is worth it. Another crack and strike there from range. 120th minute in the game. Now, his other con is his strength. Yes, the stat was terrible, but you can kind of avoid that con because he's that good at dribbling. He's that good at keeping the ball at his feet. I mean, just look at some of these runs. The Defenders don't get near him, yes this is bad defending, but you just can't touch Paulo Futra when he's in this kind of form, and he does win a penalty, that's why he's getting a 5 out of 5 star rating lads, he's just that good, and I hope every legend I do try on, try on, I'm not fucking wearing them, I do try from now on. That's the phrase I was looking for, and he does finish with that 98 penalty stat. Kraken stat, it's a nice little stutter pen, and he just puts it to the left-hand side. The keeper with absolutely no chance whatsoever. As we come forward with the last goal then in this episode, I hope you did enjoy it, by the way. It is my last one on current gen. All my future player reviews, inform analysis, legend analysis, whatever it may be, will all be in next gen. So I hope you did enjoy. Leave a like if you did. Subscribe if you haven't, and I will catch you all next time.